guys welcome back so this is the third video in the fountain head palace series and we have uh, cleared the mebu manor now we are moving ahead into the fountain head palace and there lies the sakura tree where a mini boss is waiting for us so yeah we'll go ahead so i'll just jump and catch this grapple point i can see few items there so i'll just try to pick it up okay there is one okami warrior so we have to sneak there is one more enemy there waiting at the rooftop there i can see a grapple point but let me just explore this region we can avoid the enemies just by going under the bridge okay yellow marks okay this lightning wolves i'll select a shuriken i don't want to go near there are two warriors standing there if we kill anyone the other will be alerted we don't want that right now Yeah, it's safe to kill this wolf from a distance. Okay, so there is one Shichiman warrior. He's a mini boss. We don't need to face him right now. We'll just go near an idol nearby and activate it. Yeah, got it.
so this is the beautiful fountain and palace just check out guys it's beautiful indeed and it's night by the way the shiny moon there okay that's a lizard we don't need to worry about it right now so yeah we reached the checkpoint but there's an pot noble we we'll speak to him okay purchase let's see so we have nine carp scales we can buy this lapis lazuli see guys this is an important item because if we are going to upgrade our prosthetic tools so at the last uh, last level i would say we require this lapis lazuli and right now we have only 8 uh, so we can buy one lapis lazuli for second one we have to kill some carps some fishes and yeah also killing that shichiman warrior we can we will be getting one lapis lazuli divine confetti Okay, I think we don't have any collectible here. So yeah, guys, we have comfortably reached to the next checkpoint. So that's it for this video. We'll cover the Fountainhead Palace in the next part as well. So adios and take care.